Assalamu alaikum. Brothers and sisters, welcome to the recipe book. Today we will be bringing you some fantastic food from around the world from our chef, Brian Jubril, and he's from London. If I like to bring Brian on, please, Brian. Yeah, yeah. assalamu alaikum. <laughs> How are you? Alhamdulillah, you good? Alhamdulillah, mashallah, mashallah. So, what are you going to be cooking for us today? Well, actually, I've been cooking for you some buffalo wings, wow. which is a. Uh, uh, original Caribbean menu, okay. which is something that is very savoury and good and very nice as a treat. Uh -huh. So we're doing yeah. Caribbean food today? Caribbean food today, yes. Okay, uh, and what are we doing to accompany the buffalo wings? We'll be doing some uh, some salad, uh, which is... Uh, um, I can see an avocado, <laughs> avocado. so we're doing avocado, avocado salad, salad, yeah? Avocado salad, yes, okay, yeah. Uh, and something to sweeten the buds, anything? Yeah, I'm thinking about doing some punch. Okay, a punch? Like, like a peanut punch. Which that's is, interesting. Yes, very something that's very very kickly make you smile. As a girl, well, it's, ca it's a smile. Caribbean. It's Jamaican. <laughs> it's going to be a chill out show today. Is, Alhamdulillah. Is, okay, so what we're we going to start with? Uh, we're going to start with by uh, the chicken, seasoned chicken, washing okay. the chicken, make sure it's clean, and yep. then season it, and then deep fry it. Yep. And then hopefully we will get everything done. Insha'Allah. Okay, now boys, do you need me to do anything? Yes, please. I need to get me the chicken. Okay. So. <laughs> Order me around straight away. Why not? Let's get some chicken out. There you go. Is this one we need? Yeah, that's what we needed. There you go. And uh, first, we need to get some vinegar. 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 I think this is the vinegar here. Yeah, the vinegar here. Okay. And we need to. Uh, Make sure it's washed properly. Why? I'm, I'm sure this would just come out of a packet. So why are we washing it? Uh, it should, it should know, be clean. It should be fresh. Not really. It's just the, the way they prepare it in the butcher shop. Okay. Is like exactly where you take it home. Yeah. You have to make sure it's, you're the one consuming it. So you okay. make sure it's clean properly. Right. So that's the most important. And in Islam, you have to make sure everything is clean as well. I, I, I suppose it's uh, similar to like before we pray our salah, we do our wudu and we cleanse ourselves. So yeah. as we're cleaning, uh, consuming the food? Precisely. I understand, I understand. Okay, that, uh, that's good. So just a quick wash. Why the vinegar though? This is uh, Isn't tap water just enough? No, no, that is not enough. Because you need to make sure that it is done properly and cleaned properly. Okay. So and I also have lime as well in it to, you know, to give it a bit of a good scrub. Oh, okay. So. That's, that's... Is this a Caribbean thing or is it just you just uh, knowing just this? Really, just, just me, you being, just me being over, 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 over cautious. Yeah, because you have to make sure that everything is done properly. That's good. So we've got vinegar, water and lime. Lime. Washing the chicken. Does it leave a residue on the chicken though? Uh, not really. Okay. You just make it uh, just really clean. Really, it uh, cleans it. Cleans it. <laughs> cleans it to make sure it's very nice. And okay. So you've done it properly. So it washing up liquor wouldn't do the same job? No, no, definitely. All right, not. fine. We use washing up liquor for that, for that one. Then we're going to uh, just cut it. Cut off these um, bits. Oh, the little little niblet bits. Little niblet bits, which you're going to discard it. Yes. Okay, that, that's and good. That's good. Just. Oh, you cut them in two? Cut in two pieces. Okay. To make life easier for us. So, how, how many uh, wings are we going to be doing today? Uh, we're just going to do about uh, eight, eight pieces. Eight wings. Eight wings. What, serve what, two people, three people? Yeah, it depends on how much people want to have. <laughs> yeah, exa well, yeah, you know that. But the, the one thing is, uh, it, it seems like a very Moorish food. Uh, so once you taste it once, you think, you're going to go back, you're going to go back, you're going to go back, you're going to go back. You're, it's uh, that you have to have more. Yeah. You, two pieces never enough. Yeah, yeah well. you're always going to want it more. Okay. Do you cook this kind of food in your restaurant? Yeah, it's, this is um, very popular. Okay. Uh, very much popular and it's one thing that goes off the shelf quickly. Uh, anything else I've got in the shop. Flies out the door. Flies out the door so yeah. fast. The, these are very popular with the kids as yeah. well. Yeah. Oh, and for those who want a little bit of snack, just like a small snack. I well, you just... can tell I like a small snack every few minutes, you know. <laughs> 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 I don't know about that one. <laughs> yeah, so right, it's one of these. Uh, in, in, you know, it's, it's all good. It's all good. Well, after we um, 
Okay, after, this, after, after this you out. cleansed it, yeah. yeah, you cleaned it, you chopped Without it, then we discarded, placed in the. Um, then we had um, some. So what spices we're we using today? We now we are using uh, normal chicken. I mean, all-purpose seasoning. Okay, G we, generic all-purpose all seasoning. Which because is it has everything this one. Is in it. Okay. Everything is in it. Has your salt, your ginger, your ginger, garlic, yeah. and, and, and so forth. It's easy, easily then, yeah, uh, available then we in have, shops. Um, pimento and uh, with the seasoning salt. So we just. Okay. How, how much of each do we put in? Um, That's about a teaspoon. A teaspoon? A teaspoon of each. Okay. A teaspoon of each. And you just put it straight in? We just put it straight in. Okay. Just, just bring it over like that. Yep. But you have to just not too much, just a little bit at a time. Oh, yeah. And you just... Is that salt? Seasoning salt? Seasoning salt. Seasoning salt, okay, fine. You, nice. you just rub it in. And just marinate, just marinate all, all, the yeah, all the spices together. together. Okay, that's... You can see the colour of the chicken taking shape straight shape. away. It has the colour. Yeah. And the taste as well. It's going to be beautiful. Washing hands down every time you touch poultry, very important. Very important to yep. wash it and each time you angle raw meat because definitely the, the summer lion. Then we're gonna uh, deep, we're gonna flour. There you go, Brian, okay. sofa is in flour. Sure. Why is it sofa is in flour? Uh, we need to have it buttered. So okay. not buttered with the, as in liquid, it's just buttered over it to give it, uh, when it fries, it's not too a, dry. A, a crispy texture? Just not too dry, it's crispy yeah. texture. Okay, yeah. that's, that's good. So we just sprinkle the flour. So how, how much flour do we put over the top? So not much, just a little bit to... Uh, just enough to cover, cover it. it. Cover yeah, basically cover, 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 the, it, yeah, so. cover the front. So you just cover Let's it like that. get rid of these. This is like the... Because um, you can buy pre-made um, seasoning, like with flour and everything. So. But it's quite expensive, so this is a lot cheaper. It's than much cheaper than the yeah. actual bun, and if you, in, it's much easier for you to do. And it's if you have it in the home, mm -hmm. it's in your cupboard. Instead of you going seasoning ingredients in the cupboard, in you the don't cupboard. have to go out and no. spend a few pounds on something. This so is, this is relatively quite a cheap meal. Quite then. cheap and easy meal, yes. Yeah, that's good. So now we're gonna have some oil, okay, and um, Okay, so, so we're going to be shallow frying, shallow frying it. the wings. Wings, yes. Okay, nice. Make sure it's very hot first while we prepare the, um, the sauce to go. And so the what two chicken. sauces have we got here? This one is barbecue sauce. Right. And Just this is tradition, traditional barbecue Just sauce? Traditional barbecue sauce and chili sauce. Okay, which is chili standard. sauce or sweet chili sauce? Sweet chili. Fine, okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut up a few vegetables, uh -huh. uh, which is uh, onion, to, to accompany just accompany the the chili sauce. Fine. Okay. So while the pan is heating up, we, heat we, up, we can produce this. So we just put this on here. Put this on the side. It's not hot yet. When it's yeah. hot. <laughs> not hot enough. It's not hot enough. No. Uh, so just put a little bit more while I cut this one up. Could you cut the? What, what would you like me to cut? <laughs> to cut? Do you want to cut the onion? Yes, we'll cut the onion. Okay. It makes me cry with it. <laughs> uh, I, I know how onion make, uh, Yes, onion's one of them things. Uh, just do the onion for me. No. <laughs> <laughs> While I get the, I've uh, got my knife in my hand. Okay, fine, no worries. How would you like it cut? In small pieces. Yeah, small cubes, yeah? Small cubes. No worries at all. Need a small pieces like this. How, how, how many in, do you need? Just the whole one, or no, just uh, half onion, just to half an onion, onion, just to give it some flavour. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, some garlic. No worries. This should be, should be doing my job, eh? No, 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 <laughs> not, not yet, not yet, not yet. <laughs> there you go. You, you need some garlic as well, as you? yeah? Just some garlic. How some much garlic? garlic. Just, a, just a little bit of garlic crushed. Okay. Brothers and sisters, while we're prepping this veg, I've just been told we need to go to a quick break. So, inshallah, please stay tuned and we will see you in a few minutes. Jazakallah khairan, wa alaikum as-salam.
Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to the recipe book. Uh, Brian, what are we doing now? We are going to uh, fry the meat. Is the pan hot enough? It's very hot indeed. Oh, yes. you can see the steam. I, I, I'm sure the viewers at home can see the steam from the overhead camera on this. So it's just a shallow fryer, I'm assuming. It's a shallow fryer, yes. Do you need me to do anything? Uh, yes, do you cut me some pepper, please? Which pepper would you like? Uh, the, the red and the green ones. Red and green. How, how would you like it? Uh, fine as possible. Fine as possible, yeah. No worries at all. <clears throat> so, how long have you been cooking for? Oh, 10, 15 years. Really? Yeah. Who got you into cooking in the beginning? I watched my mom, really. Okay. She's the one that, she's my inspiration. Okay. You know. uh, what was the first dish she made you that inspired you to get into cooking? Curry goat. It's one of them, the first ones. Curry goat? Yep. So, when, we, when you come back on a possibly another show, will you be doing that curry goat one day? Definitely I would be doing that. Inshallah. We can ask the viewers to send in some emails. Hashtag at the recipe book. Send us in some recipes that you've done at home, with pictures you've done at home. Uh, be it from you've copied uh, or you've imitated what the chefs have done on here. Alternatively, send us what you need and we can try and implement it. Honestly, what do you think, Brian? If we get some recipes from our viewers at home, uh, and, and then they'll say, okay, fine, uh, then we can try and do it justice. What do you reckon? I think that's a brilliant idea. Oh, last finish. There you go, some, here's some pepper here. What else would you like? That Green is, pepper? No, that's fine. That's, that's it? That's fine, yeah. Okay, no worries. Are you going to chop it chop up into little bits? Now the chefy stuff comes in, doesn't it? <laughs> you know? I'll do the prep work and he gets all the glory. <laughs> Come on, man. That's terrible. Okay, so we've got the peppers, peppers. we've got the onions, and the... Garlic, I garlic, see Yep, okay, garlic, fine. And then we have a little bit of thyme. Okay, so thyme. Thyme on it. Just to give it flavour. Right. And anything else we're going to be adding into I this? I think that should be it. So now we're we just going to put this straight into the pan? No, we're actually not going to do We're going to mix the, um, the barbecue, barbecue, sauce. barbecue sauce. Okay. And we're going to project this in the barbecue sauce to give it a bit of colour as well. A little bit of extra texture. Exactly. Okay, that's interesting. I'm assuming the guy's mouth is watering so far. You know, <laughs> Abu Bakr's got his, literally his tongue hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> if the viewers could see this, it would be a classic shot. You know, <laughs> from the left. So how long does this, the, does the chicken take? Well, the chicken takes about uh, uh, three to five minutes. Depends on how. It depends on the thickness, isn't thickness it? Bit, how, yeah. how would you check if it's cooked or not cooked? What's the easiest way to check? Uh, you have to break it open. Okay. You break it open. So I might have had some more oil in it. That's it. That's enough oil. So uh, I'm assuming if it's still bloody and gooey no. and everything inside? You cannot eat it now. You cannot eat it. Cooked properly. Right, okay. So if you had all the dishes in the world laid out in front of you, what would be your favourite dish? Aki and saltfish. Sorry? Aki and saltfish. Aki and saltfish? Mm -hmm. I, uh, I never heard of it. Never heard of it. Well, it's the it was a national dish. Caribbean, uh, Caribbean uh, okay. Jamaican national dish. Okay. Which is, uh, is, is kind of codfish. Okay. And um, anaki. Uh, what's anaki? Aki, no, aki. A not aki, aki. <laughs> not aki, aki, no. <laughs> Are we going to chop, chop someone up? No, 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 no. Not that no? Kind of aki. It's a, it's, it's a, this one goes in the tree. It's a very different to. Um, is it a fruit, vegetable? Fruit, like a fruit. Okay, 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 okay. The fruits, more like a vegetable. Basically. Okay. Vegetable, sorry, yes. Yep. Oh, I can hear the sizzling there. We need to check on the chicken. Yeah, we're coming on. So nicely. it's cod and aki. Aki. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll call it that. Aki in my head is just like a person, really. But brothers, sisters, please, 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 well, like, do not cut people up and add them to your cooking. Not part of Islam here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, uh, Brian, carry yeah, on. Yeah, that's it, yeah. So is, is it mainly like fried chicken you've done there, and then the barbecue, uh, to make it the buffalo, is the flavouring after, I'm assuming? Yes, it is, definitely. Okay. So what happened uh, after you fried it, more like, when it's well, well done fried, then yep. we, we had the rest of the, um, the product on it, we were going to eat this warm a little bit. Yeah. We're going to warm yes. it up? Yeah, we're going to warm it in the pan. In the same pan? No, different pan. Okay, different pan. So you're going to get... You need another frying pan? You get a small... Oh, we got one here. You got one there? Yeah. Okay, that's much. Looks like we're losing all our frying pans. <laughs> <laughs> Brothers, we need some more frying pans. <laughs> if anyone would like to donate some frying pans to us, please, hashtag recipe book. 
<laughs> okay. Again, uh, we put oil in there or just put No, we straight? just add butter. Okay. Oh, butter. Butter. How much butter would you put in? It's a small, it's a small cube. That's a cube. My wife always says at home when it comes to butter, how did you put too much butter in? <laughs> I mean, mm, it adds to the taste, adds to the texture, adds to the flavor, and adds to the waistline. <laughs> what can you do? Just one of these things. Then so we so we just melt the butter down. Just melt the butter down, okay. and then we're gonna add. Um, let me just turn this a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's like chicken chopped fried chicken. Exactly, like fried chicken. But I'm assuming it's got like because the fried chicken in the shop you have two types. You have the just normal chicken, and mm -hmm. then you have the spicy fried chicken. So this has got a little bit zingy taste. Zingy taste, yeah. yeah. Okay, that's good. My favorite chicken. Te technically, this is favorite chicken. Yeah, technically. Yeah. This is so now we have the uh, butters. Um, Juno, please wait. Please wait, Juno. You can come on once we serve up, but please. <laughs> please wait, Juno. <laughs> okay, Brian, how about if you cut the pineapple and I'll take the chickens out? Yes, please. Yes, yeah? sir. Go for it, my friend. Abu Bakr, have you got health and safety in, in the kitchen there, mate? <laughs> yeah, cool. Yeah, okay, that's brilliant. Thanks for that. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, um, Brian, turn the gas off? Yes, please. Oh, that's not that one. There you go. So we've got the chicken all ready. That's good. So are we preparing the we avocado salad? We're preparing the avocado salad, yeah. Okay. So how, how did you compile this dish? It's, uh, it's something that I always uh, wanted to do. Mm -hmm. Something different. It's something um, Caribbean, but something different, something exotic. That's why I call it exotic. Um, what was your name <laughs> for this dish? <laughs> it's called exotic. Um, the name of it? <laughs> Avocado. <laughs> Exotic avocado <laughs> and mango. Exotic avocado and mango. Yeah. Okay. That's perfect. <laughs> so, uh, did your mum teach you this recipe? Or? No, no, no. It's something that I picked up. You picked as up I for yourself? For myself, so. Okay, that's good. So, how much pineapple compared to avocado and. You don't want to put too much pineapple because it's overpowering. So it, it looks like we put half a pineapple in. Ah, that should do fine. Anyway. Yeah, okay. And how much mango are we going to put That's in? Just half a mango. Half a mango. These ain't the Asian mangoes, are they? It, it looks though. No, <laughs> it's it's Asian mangoes are the honey yellowy, yellowy colour ones. This is more of a... It okay. doesn't... Wait, it doesn't look like Jamaican mango. So is it, you got a Jamaican mango? We have, yeah, we've got Jamaican mangoes. Why, why are you doing this? Eh? You come on our show and you bring <laughs> us a Jamaican mango. Come uh, on, this is like honey mangoes. Honey mangoes. Honey mango. Now uh, we're gonna have the, the spices to the chicken. Okay. Oh, your sweet and sour. Sweet and sour. Sweet and sour barbecue Bar sauce with the buffalo wings, peppers, garlic, peppers, and garlic. onions. So we're gonna. So you just pour it over the top. Over the top. Okay. And give it a good mix. I'm give it a good mix. Yes, it is. that's good. It's a lot different colour than the barbecue wings we get in uh, shops. It definitely. It, they're more, well, it's more brown, isn't it, Juno? Because like the meal we had the other day with the barbecue wings, you know, there was more brown and sticky and gooey. Yeah. yeah. And, and oily. oily. <laughs> well, this is it. We have the buffalo wings. Mm -hmm. What we're going to do is to plate it out after we, okay. we've done it. After the we're doing salad. avocado. So, so we're going to cut the avocado. This is your avocado? Yep. How, how would you tell a ripe or good avocado? Uh, first, when you go to the shop and you okay. pick up something, you have to make sure it's soft. Okay, so yeah, and there's, soft? Well, it depends on how soft you want it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that, um, that's an answer. <laughs> yeah, there's different uh, type of pear we have. We have the green skin. This is the green skin. Yep. We have the red skin. Okay. Uh, red ones. Is it different and texture, different taste? It's the same taste. Okay. Uh, but you have the one that's uh, more darker. Yes. And you, some of them, when they're ripe, yep. they change color. But this one okay. doesn't change color. So this one doesn't change. Okay, fine, no worries. So we just beat it. 
So what would you do? You just slice it down the slice middle? Slice it down the middle like that. And twist it and take the stone out? Yeah, okay. Oh, you're taking a quarter? Take a quarter. Quarter of the avocado. Yeah, so to hop in it, you just cut it. Straight down the middle? Straight down the middle and cut it. It's fine. Cool. And what do you do? You skin it or you just leave the skin on? No, just put the skin on. Just peel it like that. Oh, it's a peel? Okay. No, no, it's, nice, when it's nice ripe, it's just easy peeled. Okay, that's interesting. And then what are you going to do with the avocado after? You cut into little chunks or...? You can cut in chunks or you could have it um, in mashed. mashed. Okay. But I like it old. Old? I mean like inch in, in uh, cubes. Oh, okay, fine, fine, fine. Cubes. So, so yeah. everything's symmetrical and so everything, cubes, everything looks yeah. the same. Okay, so that, that's good. So sometimes it's getting hard to come out sometimes, so you have to just actually peel it. So brothers and sisters, as you can see, um, we've prepared some barbecue wings. Uh, we're doing some buffalo wings. Buffalo, buffalo wings. wings. <laughs> <laughs> Just like I won't them for the correction there. Uh, please never correct me again. <laughs> um, <laughs> and then we are doing some avocado uh, salad. And this is a Jamaican theme. So it's having a laugh, having a joke. Uh, please write in. Um, with some recipes and some ideas which you have. If you're enjoying the show, it would be nice to hear from you. Mum, no, please, please, mum, no. <laughs> Thank you. We need a, are we just gonna put it straight into a bowl? It's straight into a bowl. Oh, there you go. This one, nice and easy. Then we're gonna get some, um, good cut me. Some spinach. Spinach, yeah. Okay. What, one, two, three leaves? Oh, three leaves. Three leaves. This is tough spinach, Brian. Mm -hmm. There you go. Is this going in the salad as well? Yeah, it's going straight in the salad. Not cooking it? Nope. Do you need to eat raw salmon? No, we can't eat raw spinach. You yeah, raw spinach? No, you can't eat raw spinach. Why not? For Asian. Asian <laughs> spinach. <laughs> really, really tasty. And then the spinach just spinach on top? Spinach just on top. Okay. Just on the top. Do you need the spinach? Hmm? Do you need to have spinach? Nope. Oh. It's just you putting spinach just in it? Just you putting spinach in it. Yeah. Alright, fine. Thanks. <laughs> there you go. There you go. How good does this look so far? Right. Nice plate of buffalo wings. And then you're going to put the salad on the side or just... Put the side of it. There you go. There you go. Brian, peanut punch, delight. What's required for it? Most important thing, peanut. Peanuts. So, okay. you need peanut. Milk. How much milk have you put in there? Uh, with 16. 16 ounces. ounces. 6 ounces of milk. Okay, fine. Then how much peanuts uh, have you one. put in? It all depends on how much peanut you want in here. In here. How peanut you want it to taste? Yeah, yeah? peanut it to taste. Okay. So you peanut, yeah. So you put peanut and then two handfuls. That two was. Handful, yes. And then you just crush it. Up. You just crack up the blender. Crack up the blender. Yeah. Okay. Obviously, the guys on the other here are talk properly with this because of the noise. Okay. I'm just gonna pour this straight in. I'm gonna pour it straight in here. Some You're going to top optional. it off. Yeah. Optional, if you o want. Optional, optional, optional. So, please explain to us what we have. Uh, what we have is uh, avocado, is that it's salad. Avocado. Buffalo wings, mm -hmm. and we also have peanut punch. Peanut punch. With the cream on top. <laughs> has to have the cream on top. Definitely has to. Yeah, the finishing touch. So, brothers and sisters, please try this at home. It, it's something that we've had some amazing, we had some fun doing this. And obviously, I hope you've enjoyed the show with us. Try this at home. Please email in to us at hashtag the recipe book. And here we go. Just on a quick recap on an amazing Jamaican theme show we had today. We had our buffalo wings. We had our avocado salad. A peanut butter punch shake. 16 wings feeds about four people on that we had our barbecue sauce our chili sauce our scotch bonnet wow that was hot a salad the start of the show was the avocado with a bit of pineapple and mango and fresh spinach peanut butter punch 
you have your ice creams, you have your oats, you have your mangoes, and you have your bits and bobs added to it. Brothers and sisters, hope you enjoyed the show. Come back, send us your recipes, send us some pictures, even better still, send us the food. Until next time, my recipe book, Assalamu Alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. Thank you.